I'm Dr. Burgess from Countryside Veterinary Clinic, and we've realized that some of our clients often have questions about how often to vaccinate their dogs. So my assistant, Danielle, is gonna ask me some of these questions that we get commonly, and I'm gonna answer them for you. Dr. Burgess, when does my puppy or dog need to be vaccinated? Typically, we start vaccinating puppies at eight weeks of age, and if you get a new dog from a shelter, then uh, sometimes they have vaccines, but sometimes they don't have all the vaccines that we would typically recommend. So we ask you to, at the very least, send us your vaccine record so we can tell you whether your dog is up to date, but you should be bringing them in to see us when you first get them anyway to make sure that they're healthy and we can always review their vaccines and see if there's any additional ones that we recommend for our area. How many times a year does my dog need vaccination? Typically, adult dogs need to come in once a year for vaccines. Not every vaccine needs to be boosted every year. Rabies and distemper, once you've got the initial series on board, tend to be boosted every three years. But once a year is for Lyme, leptospirosis, Bordetella, canine influenza, so you should expect to bring your dog in once a year for vaccines. And then when they're puppies and they're getting brand new vaccines, more frequently for boosters. Can there be any variations in the puppy and dog vaccine schedule? Yeah. As I said, um, puppies, because it's their first experience with the vaccine, do need to get boosters of most of our vaccines uh, as puppies. Uh, some vaccines require more boosters, some require fewer, but we're going to work out that vaccine schedule with you when we meet your dog. Is it safe to get multiple dog vaccinations at the same time? Typically, it is very safe. Uh, rarely, we have dogs who have vaccine reactions, which are allergic reactions to vaccines. That's not typically associated with getting more vaccines at once, but to a specific vaccine. If a dog does have a vaccine reaction, we may split up the vaccines in the future to try to determine which vaccine they are sensitive to. But typically we do multiple vaccines per visit and the dogs do very well. What is titer testing and is it effective? Titer testing tests the level of antibodies to a given disease in the body. I don't believe that a lot of the titers have been validated to show that titer levels prove that your dog is protected, so we still do recommend following the American Animal Hospital Association vaccine schedule for canines. However, there are certain dogs who aren't able to get vaccines, such as dogs undergoing chemotherapy or who have had uh, serious vaccine reactions, and in those cases we may think about doing titers just as a, as a measure of knowing how well we think they might be protected. Does my puppy need to restart boosters if they miss a vaccination? That's really gonna depend on the vaccination, how long overdue they are for boosters, and the veterinarian's discretion. So I recommend talking to your specific veterinarian if you are overdue about whether or not to restart. The best thing to do would be to stay on schedule as best as possible. And if for any reason you anticipate you might miss an appointment and you want to talk about to the doctor before that about whether when you can come in uh, and still not have to get boosters please give us a call if you have any other questions or concerns about vaccine schedules or frequency call us and we're always here to talk to you